all of these families are waiting here to see if they have got the papers that will allow them to leave Lesbos. In many cases, they have been here for days and they now want to go on to other parts of Europe. In the meantime, they are really stuck here until they get those papers and the conditions they're living in, well, they're not great. In fact, aid workers and charities have described them as dreadful. You can see the amount of rubbish that is lying around here. And people have been complaining about the lack of water, the lack of food that's available, and the lack of toilets. In fact, if you take a look in that rubbish, you will find dirty nappies. Meanwhile, tents have been set up all over the place. That's for those who are lucky enough to have some shelter. Clothes are hanging up in the background just to get dry. People are having to live among what is really wasteland. It's been described as a refugee camp, but it's little more than wasteland, to be honest. And, and the big problem is just that lack of shelter. The sun is beating down and there is very, very little relief from it. As a result, people are sheltering, as you can see, underneath trees and in the tents that they have brought. But these are not ideal conditions. And the truth is, is that there is more and more pressure on the Greek authorities and Europe to do more.